I'm Margaret Brennan in Washington, and this week on Face the Nation, Omicron's winter wave continues to threaten the unprotected. We'll talk exclusively this morning with House Speaker Nancy Pelosi. Across America, temperatures are plunging, COVID cases are spiking, and the Biden administration is struggling to communicate just where we are with COVID and how best to fight it. Having COVID in the environment here and in the world is probably here to stay. We're going to be able to control this. Is the criticism of the administration's messaging on COVID justified? We'll talk with the new mayor of New York City. Democrat Eric Adams. His city is an epicenter of the Omicron surge and facing the challenge of keeping kids safe in school. Former FDA Commissioner Dr. Scott Gottlieb will also be with us. Plus, with the clock now ticking in a midterm election year, congressional Democrats are feeling the pressure to get things done fast. First item up, reforming voting laws. It's not a voting rights bill. It's a sprawling, sweeping takeover of our democracy. But same old problems. Republicans are not on board. Outside Washington, some states have passed laws restricting ballot access. Others have expanded it. Georgia Secretary of State Brad Raffensperger rebuffed former President Trump's attempt to tamper with the results of the 2020 election. Now he's overseeing controversial new voting laws in his state. Election expert David Becker will also be with us. It's all just ahead on Face the Nation. Good morning and welcome to Face the Nation. 